air around us, the atmosphere. Take a take in gla- empty glass tumbler. It is really empty. Let us pu- perform an act, an act to find out. P- press a piece of cotton wool into the bottom of the tumbler. Hold the tumbler upside up the upside down and and insert into a bowl of water without tilting it. Does the water enter the tumbler? Take the Take the glass out without tilting. Fill the cotton at the bottom with the dry or wet. What does this shows? Once again insert the tumbler upside down into the bowl of water. This time tilt the tumbler when you in, when it is inside in the water. Can you observe the bubbles coming out of and feel the cotton? It is wet now. What does this show? When you tilt the tumbler, the air escapes out. The water could not enter the tumbler. The activity shows the air occupies space. Even an empty tumbler is full of air. We cannot see air because it is transparent and has no time, has no color. But it is present to all around us. There are there is a black blanket of of air surrounding the earth. It is called the atmosphere. It extends about a thousand kilometer above surface of the earth. However, the air gets thinner as we grow up. This is why mountainers who climb high mountains, they 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 take they, they take their own supply of oxygen. Ninety nine percentage of air is found to a height of thirty kilometer above the surface of the earth. The composition of air. Until the eighteenth century, people thought the air was a singular single substance. Then in 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 seventeen seventy four, Joseph. Presley showed the part of air was the gas oxygen. It means that air is a mixture and not a single substance. Air is a mixture of gas mainly of containing nitrogen about seventy eight percentage by by volume and oxygen about twenty one percentage by volume. The remaining one percentage made up of gas called argon about zero point nine nine centimeter sorry percentage. Carbon dioxide zero point zero three percentage and small amount of other gases, very varying quantities of dust, smoke and water vapor are, are also present. The are present. The amount of these air varies from place to place, and from time to time, air contains oxygen. Air contains oxygen. Air contains carbon dioxide. Air contains very little carbon dioxide, only zero point zero three percentage. However, it is very crucial component of air. We we take in oxygen of air while breathing and taking it out carbon carbon dioxide. During burning, also oxygen is used up and carbon dioxide is given given out. Air contains water vapor. The amount of water vapors in air varies from place to place and from time to time. Mumbai has more water vapor than Delhi throughout the year. This is because Mumbai is situated near the sea and there is a lot of evaporation of sea water because of the heat of the sun. In Delhi, the the air contains more water vapors during the rainy season than other 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 times of the year. The amount of water vapor in the air is known as Humidity. Air contains dust and smoke. The air supports life. Oxygen. So all living things breathe in oxygen. Uh, oxygen. Oxygen is necessary for them to get energy from food. Since living things and need uh, all the time, all the time for various. Life process. They need to breathe in oxygen all the time. The process of breathing in, getting energy from food, and breathing out in 
is called respiration. Living things on land breathe in, in the presence of the air. The air you breathe throughout your nose goes to the lungs. And the, here the oxygen is absorbed from air and used for by the body. Living things that the live, live under the soil breathe in air present in the soil. You may know have noticed that if you too much water is given to the soil in a garden or farm so as to cause water logging the earthworms that live under the soil starts coming up to the surface that is because the water drives out all the air from the soil plants such as mangroves and that that grow in water logged soil have roots that grow out of soil in the air to get air some animals that live in water example whale whales come up to the water surface to breathe in oxygen from the air other the other animals example fish breathe in oxygen dissolves in water fish have or, uh, organs called gills instead of lungs if water passes through the gills oxygen dissolved in the water is absorbed